Hello everybody, welcome. I'm back with a rather interesting mod pack uh, that I found. Uh, so this is Nightmare Craft uh, and it's for... Fucking hell, the music is damn loud, even a moment. So this is Nightmare Craft for Minecraft 1.18.2. Um, it caught my eye because while I was looking through videos on... Uh, the like the, the so-called the newest mods around i chanced upon like this nightmare craft uh, mod that i was like thinking okay so it's just a cool little mod then i found out that it's actually a series of mods that makes into well a mod a custom made mod pack i took a look at the mod pack and they said that there is like voice acting and whatnot so i'm a bit skeptical on how how much voice acting or there i need so we're just gonna start that's where the fire will start, right? Is it loading? Oh, okay, there we go. And behold, oh, a great red oh, oh, oh. dragon having seven heads and ten horns. How the fuck? And seven crowns upon his heads. Okay, I'm not gonna, and I'm gonna shut up now. And his tail the third part of the stars of heaven, and did cast them to the earth. The great dragon was hurled down, that ancient serpent called Satan, who leads the whole world astray. He was hurled to the earth and his demons with him. A prophecy foretells of an end of days where nightmares will wage Man, carnage just and terror him. upon the world, attempting to forever oh, extinguish well. life itself. A thunderous war will take place and many will die. The heart of the world and all those souls that call it home are at stake and the winner will take all. The Dark Lord cares nothing for those he corrupts, harvesting their eternal souls to do his bidding. He asks everything, and in return, offers emptiness. If you submit and take him as your master, he will enslave you and systematically stamp out every last shred of warmth inside of you. He will bring you to your knees in final breath of life and keep you there forever. With the Dark Lord as master, all will walk the earth as empty corpses, writhing in silent, searing pain as they lead an empty and meaningless existence in eternal servitude to his dark empire, with no one to care for them but 10,000 demons for each and every person, dark leeches of evil living under their skin, inside their minds, and corrupting their hearts day and night, they will rot forever in endless agony. Though the Dark Lord's hordes cast long shadows that will enshroud you, and his insidious and creeping evil will blacken everything about you, he will fall in the face of the immense power bursting from within the hero of the ages. The time of the apocalypse has come. The world needs a great and legendary champion of light to stand up and fight and destroy the darkest nightmares in the history of creation. The courage, strength, perseverance, focus, and friendship that will be needed to conquer an unimaginable foe has yet been shown and many great heroes have already fallen in the face of evil's burgeoning malady. In a magical world filled with riches and wonders, a young kingdom has managed to keep evil at bay outside its formidable gates. But its power is waning. With its heroes cut thin, darkness gathers its strength, and the mind and soul of the king of the kingdom teeters on the edge of sickness and death. Here, the heart of the war will be waged between the hero of the ages and Satan himself. For the Dark Lord knows that whoever claims final victory in this kingdom will surely claim for themselves all the world. Seriously, how? How on earth? Well, first of all, I'm gonna pick normal because I'm not that bad at the game. But how the fuck did they goddamn make a cutscene in Minecraft along with voice acting? For fuck, holy shit! What the fuck? Oh my god, more cutscenes, Jesus! Hey, hey, wake up! What are you, Navi? Wake up! You need to run. Hmm? Oh, what? Oh, this shit. What the fuck? 
Don't let. Wait, hold on. Let me just increase my brightness because oh, because it's dark. Let them catch you. Don't let them catch you. Okay. Oh my god, that spider is huge. Oh, these spiders are not doing anything. All right. This is Stay the path, keep going. I, I'm hearing a lot. Oh shit! Oh, fuck off. I, I don't have a. Skip the werewolf. Ow, okay. I think somebody passed to me or something. Ah shit, I'm gonna die now. Yeah, I'm dead. Okay, I, I actually need to. You need to run. I actually need to be very wary. Don't let them catch you. I don't know how many times I hear the word you need to run, don't let that catch you. Stay the path, keep going. Wait, wait, wait. Alright, I just need to avoid those stupid cobwebs. They're not that hard to avoid. Garbage, that's all garbage. Run, run, run. Oh shit, it's a maze. I fucking hate mazes. I fucking hate mazes. They're gaining on you. I know, shut up. I don't say it in such a whimsical tone. You cannot run them. You're going to have to hide. I know a place ahead. Keep going. I hope the skeletons are like who are that? Okay, the skeletons are looking. Okay. Up game, ahead, so. take the broken path on the right. I'm hearing them. They're like right behind me. Don't, don't I have to restart from the start if I every time I die. Every time I die. Quickly get inside. Shut the doors behind you. Oh shit! Shh. Scan. Don't make a sound. Oh, scan me. They'll hear you. Stay hidden, right where you are. Yeah, 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 I know. Wait, follow the unicorn. <sighs> They're gone. I've sent for help. Seek out the light ahead. It will guide you. Oh my god, the world was just right there, mate. Follow the unicorn. Oh my god, there's a the unicorn. What the fuck? Oh, let's chase after the unicorn, I guess. Oh, just, just, you know, ride the unicorn and just go to where I need to. That's cool! Oh shit, it's actually like a game. It's actually, like, what I'm talking about, Minecraft is a game. It's actually like a MMORPG of some sorts. Find a way inside. Dream ride, okay. This. Ah, the fuck. Around back to safety, okay. Uh, I think there's a door here-ish. Oh shit, I can Oh, I can break stuff. Dig here, dig here, okay. Oh, I can break stuff. I don't need dirt, so I'll just put this back. <laughs> I thought it was like adventure mode, you know? Get some rest. Okay. It's safer during the day. Oh, sleep in know. a bed when the dark comes to avoid the worst. Okay. Go outside and dig through the leaves to gather sticks. You need four sticks to craft a large stick and four large sticks for a wooden axe. Before you head out, right click the chest to find a few things I left for you. Okay. Drag some food into your inventory to keep yourself from starving. You can access your inventory with E at any time. Uh, oh my god, it's just a tutorial, what the fuck? Okay. okay. Uh, use 4 6 to large. Uh, okay, so it's like this, I guess. Okay. Then use four large sticks to craft a wooden. How the fuck do you craft a wooden axe? No. Like this? What the fuck? How does that Good. look? Now you can gather wood from trees. 
And then the planks in there. Now make yourself a crafting bench from that wood. Uh, okay. It is a tutorial, what the fuck? You're gonna need to armor up for what's ahead. Okay. I was able to send you a copy of my old house, but there was some interference. Okay. Eat dirt makes a mud oven at the crafting table. Eat it up to make hardened dirt, okay. and turn that into cobblestone for better tools. From there, you can mine for iron. I thought you just go mining, huh? Okay, so uh, make a mud oven and place it down, okay. Yeah, uh, let me just finish up this, um, so-called adventure, no, uh, survival site first. And I'll get back to you.